Hi, I'm Jacob Rossi. I lead our product team that brings the web into VR and the metaverse. Like the physical world, in the metaverse, you want access to the web's virtually infinite information and services at your fingertips. And web developers want to be able to build for this new frontier. Today, I'm excited to share a number of new capabilities on both of those fronts that will advance how users experience the web and how developers build for the metaverse on the web. The web, as a platform, is well positioned for the metaverse. The metaverse is the successor to the mobile internet, and the current internet already has characteristics similar to that of the metaverse, like virtually infinite destinations, the ability to visit or share a destination quickly with links, and an open and interoperable platform for developers. New industry standards like WebXR are enabling immersive metaverse experiences in VR that work across other devices as well. So let's take a look at how we're advancing the state of the web in the metaverse through MetaQuest. On MetaQuest, we provide three fundamental technologies for the web in the metaverse. MetaQuest Browser, one of the most used apps on MetaQuest, and your portal to all the web has to offer. Progressive Web Apps, or PWAs, the developer framework that enables web developers to build apps for the MetaQuest store that are installable by users to their library with rich multitasking by default. WebXR, an innovative industry standard that gives web developers the power to build fully immersive experiences for the metaverse and leverage the power of the hardware. Let's start with MetaQuest browser. It's no surprise to me how popular the browser is on MetaQuest as it puts the internet with its billions of pieces of content at your fingertips. You can use it for information, entertainment, socializing, learning, and productivity. Today, the browser and PWAs are only available in your home environment. But just like the physical world with our phones, you want easy access to the web's virtually infinite information and services wherever you are in the metaverse. That's why we're announcing support on MetaQuest Pro for using browser and PWAs anywhere in VR. MetaQuest Pro users can pull up a browser using its overlay technology. So you can read a message, check your calendar, look up tips to beat that tricky game level, and much more without leaving the VR app you're in. And this is made possible through the expanded 12 gigabytes of RAM on MetaQuest Pro. Now, the web's wealth of information is incredibly useful in the metaverse, offering valuable entertainment, socializing, productivity, and learning opportunities. But we also know that for parents, the web can present risks for your teens. That's why we're proud to announce new and improved parental supervision features for MetaQuest Browser. In addition to the ability to block the browser entirely, which we launched earlier this year, parents will be able to enable category-specific content filters to choose what type of content is appropriate for their teen. And soon, parents will also be able to customize content filters by allowing or blocking specific website domains, including ones requested by their teens from their headset. This will give parents the tools to help their teens enjoy the web safely in the metaverse. And that's important because the web has so much to offer. Of course, not just for users, but developers too. MetaQuest's up-to-date support for web standards, including immersive technologies like WebXR, allow web developers to build for the metaverse. Last year, we began to enable web developers to publish web apps directly to the store using industry standard progressive web apps, or PWAs, so that users can discover their apps and install them to their library like any other app in VR. Since then, we've enhanced the multitasking support for PWAs, we've made input easier, such as mouse wheel emulation via the controller thumbstick, and we've improved performance, all of which make PWAs even better on MetaQuest. One of the exciting aspects of PWAs is just how easy they are to build, 
especially if you already have a modern web app. But we wanted to make them even easier to build. That's why we partnered with Microsoft to bring MetaQuest support to their PWA Builder product, a popular developer tool for creating PWAs that work across a variety of devices and stores. Here to tell us more about PWA Builder support for MetaQuest is Microsoft's Josh Satch. Thanks for the introduction, Jacob. Let's dive right in. PWA Builder is a full-featured developer suite that helps web developers be successful in the progressive web application space across phones, PCs, and now even VR. Our team has built out extensive tooling and resources to make sure that web developers can easily and seamlessly leverage all of the amazing aspects of PWAs. Since the project's genesis in 2012, We've helped all types of developers, from multinational development teams to students, helping them learn, build, and package their PWAs for the various app stores. Since then, we've activated over half a million developers worldwide and continue to strengthen the PWA developer community. This past year, our team has made some very exciting announcements. We are very excited to share with the developer community our VS Code extension that supercharges PWA development right in the developer's code editor. PWA Builder Studio has received an amazing reception from the developer community and is quickly becoming one of the most powerful and popular tools for PWA developers. One of the greatest value features of PWAs is their inherent cross-platform reach. That's why we're so happy to partner with Meta to bring the power of PWAs to MetaQuest devices. Developers can now use the PWA Builder site and VS Code extension to generate packages for Windows, Android, iOS, and now MetaQuest devices. Packaging your existing PWA is quick and intuitive using our tooling. Let's walk through packaging a PWA for the MetaQuest platform using pwabuilder.com. Head to your browser and go to pwabuilder.com and enter in the link to your PWA in the text bar. For the purposes of this demo, I'll be using webboard.app, a whiteboard application. Once PWA Builder analyzes your URL, you'll be sent to the report card page where you'll be able to see what aspects of your site need to be improved. You can then package for the various platforms and build great app experiences for your customers. In our case, webboard.app already has a manifest and service worker and meets security requirements. So we will just click on this package for store button over here. Woohoo, congrats. We've made it to the packaging modal where you can generate packages for your PWA for Windows, Android, iOS, and MetaQuest. Let's go ahead and click on the store package button in the MetaQuest section. Lastly, take that package generated from pwabuilder.com and load it into your developer enabled MetaQuest device. For more instructions on how to sideload a PWA onto MetaQuest devices, scan the QR code. So what are you waiting for? Head over to PWA Builder now to start your PWA journey. Thanks, Josh. Our support for PWAs is still early, but having great tools like PWA Builder makes it easy to build for MetaQuest. We already have a number of great apps with more and more on the way, like Dropbox, Adobe Acrobat, Coursera, and Peacock. With lots of apps and websites at your fingertips, that also means lots of usernames and passwords too. If you're like me, you've got hundreds of accounts on the internet, and remembering your usernames and passwords is a challenge. Wouldn't it be even better if in VR, you could access the passwords you already had saved on other devices? To do that, we're excited to announce we're working with LastPass, a market-leading password manager. We're honored to have Kareem Tuba, CEO of LastPass, join us to share more about how they're simplifying and securing logins everywhere, including the metaverse. Thanks for having me, Jacob. We're thrilled to be here partnering with Meta, and we're really excited to be launching LastPass as a PWA in the MetaQuest store. And in early 2023, We'll be natively integrating LastPass into the MetaQuest browser for seamless access within your VR experience. Like me, you have hundreds of accounts that are critical to how you work, live, and play online every single day. 
When access gets disrupted or isn't available, it can be pretty frustrating. With this new LastPass integration, your entire digital life is right there within reach. You'll be able to securely access the logins you need to experience the metaverse, whether you're playing games or collaborating with virtual colleagues, all without taking your headset off. With the new LastPass Vault on your MetaQuest device, you have simple access to all your passwords, credit cards, addresses, and much more. All secure by design using our zero knowledge security model that keeps your data encrypted and safe. In LastPass, you can scroll through your most common sites, select the credentials you want to copy, and simply paste them where needed so you can log in without ever having to type in a password. Whether you're logging in or completing a purchase, this is the simplest and most productive way to get into your apps for easy, secure browsing while in the metaverse. This will be available in the MetaQuest store, and we'd love for you to check it out and share your feedback with us. Even more exciting, early in 2023, we're actually making this experience more seamless. And we're doing that by integrating LastPass into the MetaQuest browser that Jacob mentioned earlier. You'll be able to automatically save and fill items into your LastPass vault directly from the site you're visiting in the metaverse. Universal access to your logins, personal information, and data should be a given, no matter which device you're using. And LastPass provides that ubiquity, whether you're at home, at work, or in the metaverse. Thanks, Kareem. Having LastPass in VR is really going to make accessing apps and information in the metaverse easier. The opportunities for the web and VR don't just stop at 2D sites and PWAs. With the power of WebXR, web developers can build powerful, immersive experience for MetaQuest 2. The new tab page of MetaQuest Browser features fun, powerful, and engaging experiences built using WebXR. And as always, if you have a great experience you want featured in the new tab page, head over to developer.oculus.com WebXR to submit your content for consideration. And today, I'm excited to announce an all new type of immersive experience you can build on the web for MetaQuest, mixed reality. Web developers can take advantage of high resolution, full color pass through on MetaQuest Pro to build immersive content that augments your physical world, opening up tons of new creative possibilities. Powered by Meta Presence platform, sites in the browser and PWAs in the store can enable pass through understand horizontal and vertical planes in your environment, and anchor objects to the physical world. We were so excited about the possibilities, we partnered with Foria Studio to build a technology showcase for MR on the web that we call Spatial Fusion. Take a look. Spatial fusion is just a taste of what you can do with mixed reality on the web. You'll find it soon at spatialfusion.io and featured in the MetaQuest browser new tab page. MR for the web is possible through the latest WebXR industry standards. Enabling pass-through is as simple as requesting an immersive AR session for WebXR. Using planes from the scene is also easy. Just query the detected planes property of the XR animation frame, and you'll get the planes of the guardian walls, ceiling, 
floor, and any furniture like couches or desks that the user has set up in their Guardian settings. And anchors are as simple as using the create anchor method of the XR animation frame and providing a pose and reference space for the anchor. One of the things that we improved was advancing the standard to support saving anchors locally so that anchors can be persisted in a space over multiple sessions using MetaQuest. MR for the web will launch on MetaQuest Pro. But what's great is that we're bringing these capabilities to MetaQuest 2's pass-through as well. So you can build for all the users of MetaQuest 2 and enjoy the best experience on MetaQuest Pro. We'll have updated documentation and samples soon at developer.oculus.com slash WebXR. Of course, WebXR can build VR experiences too, and we have exciting updates there. We're launching a developer preview of Project Flowerbed, a new VR experience for the web designed and built by Meta. Project Flowerbed is designed to showcase what's possible, develop best practices, and push boundaries on quality. Project Flowerbed is an immersive, meditative garden building experience. Choose your flowers and trees to plant, water them and watch them grow. Take pictures of your handiwork and return again and again to relax in the serenity of your creation. We're launching Project Flowerbed to help developers learn best practices for performance, interaction, asset optimization, and more. But you don't have to just be inspired by Project Flowerbed you can leverage what we learned directly because Project Flowerbed will be open source. Check out DM Lau and Scott Nagy's talk, Build Great WebXR Experiences, for a deep dive on Project Flowerbed and the best practices we developed. Or if you just want to relax in your own virtual botanical garden, you'll find a developer preview of Project Flowerbed at the URL shown here, with the full experience coming soon. The web platform on MetaQuest offers developers advanced opportunities to build 2D, VR, and MR experiences for the metaverse. For users, MetaQuest Browser provides at your fingertips access to information, services, and immersive destinations in the metaverse, now available on MetaQuest Pro from inside any VR app. PWAs make it easy to discover and save the most important 2D and immersive web apps to your MetaQuest library. And WebXR brings VR and MR capabilities to the web, including new advancements on MetaQuest Pro. To get started, launch browser on MetaQuest and try out the developer preview of Project Flowerbed today, Spatial Fusion in the coming weeks, or any of your favorite websites. And if you're a developer, Head over to one of the URLs on the screen to learn how to make your existing sites work great in MetaQuest browser, how to build a PWA for MetaQuest, or how to build VR and MR experiences using WebXR. The metaverse is an exciting new frontier, and the web will be front and center in that endeavor. We're excited to see what you build for it. <laughs>